great offense. You know, they uh, averaging like 500, 400, 500 yards a game. So we knew they had a great offense, but we have a great defense too. So and we, we felt like it was going to be a steal, maybe, and they made a few plays on us, a few too many. And we just have to get better. From was it was it fun to watch the offense run up and down the field like they did? Uh, it was definitely it was definitely exciting. You know, seeing the offense put up those type of yards and numbers against those guys, they uh, helped us out a good bit this game because we didn't play all baseball. You're entering uh, the bye week. You got the Gators. That's always a Let's say a giant game. Where are y'all running? What's this next sort of 14 days going to be like for y'all? Uh, it's no days off. You know, it's the bye week. We're going to enjoy this for uh, 24 hours. Then during, throughout the bye week, we're going to do some things, a lot of things to work on ourselves. And we're going to focus on Florida. We're, we're excited for the opportunity. You know, these night games have been pretty live. Um, what's it like seeing the, the, the kids in the student section, seeing the, the lights, et cetera, at, at going into the fourth quarter? I mean, it's exciting just seeing that type of support from our fan base and just all the, the Bulldog Nation. And it, it's just exciting having those people behind you 100 percent. So I love it and I enjoy it. Did you? It didn't seem like they could really run effectively. I don't think they had 60 yards, but the passing game. Is, is that on the front seven? Is that the DBs? Is that just everybody? Well, I feel like it's, uh, it's, it's a combination of both. We could have put more pressure on the quarterback to uh, let off some of the pressure on the defensive back. So we'll just have to get better from that and do a lot of uh, corrections. Thanks, Ron. Appreciate it. passes and big plays, it, is it almost in a way good to have this happen so you can get it on film, know what needs to be worked on in a game where you know the offense is putting up a lot of points? Well, it's never good to let that allow that on your defense ever, but I can't play like situational, like this and that, but it, it's, it's not a good feeling just having those guys make those type of plays on us, but they, they have a good offense and we expected them to make a few plays there in the SEC, so we just have to go from that, but the offense played over the game. The story has been about kind of this, this defense maybe carrying this team to a certain extent. But was it different today, the offense uh, carrying you guys? Uh, the offense definitely picked up our slack. We didn't play the way uh, we, supposed, we normally play on the defensive side of the ball. So we're just have, we're gonna have to go in this ball. We can make some adjustments and we'll have to go from there. I know the win's probably the most important thing, obviously, but you know, what are your thoughts walking away you know, how you guys play defense? Oh, that's all the Missouri. They came out, uh, played a pretty awesome game uh, on the offensive side of the ball, but we just have to make, we had to make a lot of adjustments and they, they made some plays, but we just got to go from that and, you know, hats off to the offense. They played ahead of the game. This is a good time for a bye week and you guys seem to be piling up some injuries now. Uh, it's definitely a good time for a bye week, you know, get everyone back and uh, have a good week of work, then it's off to the uh, floor. Is this game 